good morning dr shivastav uh, good morning ladies and gentlemen uh, i would like to uh, welcome dr shivastav here for this uh, conference obviously i had prepared my speech for the minister but he's he's not here so i i would uh, 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 like to say a few words regarding what dr shivastav had said and what he wanted from this uh, this conference uh, obviously this conference is uh, uh, designed to see how we can uh, decide a strategy which will be right for the land records uh, but dr shivastav raised a couple of points and i wanted to just share my experience because i have been dealing with the land records for almost uh, two decades in fact uh, we supplied our first uh, uh, total station in madhya pradesh in back in late 80s and since then we have been dealing with uh, land records uh, for various uh, application uh, dr shivastav very clearly and very correctly said that every vendor has a vested interest when they come and talk about the technology and talk about the solution and and at times uh, uh, they may be guiding uh, departments uh, according to what what they have available in their in their in their basket uh, what i would like to propose and i'm sure this is what uh, this conference will do also is to use agi which is a which is not a particular industry driven uh, technology uh, uh, center uh, to provide consultancy to to various departments uh, how to come up with a, a specification how to come up with with a with a tender which will meet the department's requirement and not a vendor's requirement i think i think and that's what agi can do agi can work with you because we understand every a state has a different requirements and i think uh, agi can can be a consultant in providing a specification because if the specification is drawn correctly then it is much easier for you to to get the right technology and right processes the other thing dr shivastu mentioned is about training you know technology as is as good as the people who are using it so if we don't train people then it doesn't matter how good technology you give them the result will not be there and my personal experience has been is that in the states where the state has put lot of emphasis on on training and now i think again we should talk about training what is you know there is a classroom training and there is a actual training and in every tender we talk about training the people but in a classroom environment in a classroom environment everything looks good but when you go into the field then the real thing you find out so i think these training should be on job training that means when the when the land records is doing their their work the vendor should be available with them for for these kind of training so and we have done this in 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 some states and the result has been fantastic because we trained patwaris how to use this modern technology because i think we are all human being and i think we we need to make us comfortable to technology for us to use the technology otherwise we will be always find a reason why this technology is not doing the job for us so i hope that the, that uh, today's uh, uh, conference uh, uh, discusses these kind of issues and and we become a partner to to uh, uh, to the land records in this modernization of the uh, land record data so with this i would like to again uh, welcome uh, dr shivastav and thank him for leading this uh, effort uh, for uh, uh, doing this kind of a session to see how industry and and, and administration can work together thank you I request Kaushik to close the session. So before we close, I just wanted to check: Does anybody have any questions or any remarks, either from AGI or does anybody have any disagreements with the way we are going to do the workshop today and the outcomes? I think there's nothing. So. How old is uh, So AGI as an association is about three plus years old. 
and the members are uh, we have about 20 